Rebecca, and I did the baking and pastry diploma program. And I'm Kay Robertson, and I did the same program. I knew I wanted to move to Portland, and it's always been my goal to go into like baking and pastry or culinary. So um, OCI just seemed like the best pick. It's affordable, great programs, awesome instructors. When I came in, I was like instantly welcomed. I worked for the summer in Cannon Beach the summer before this, and I was working in a little foodie uh, gift shop down there, and I asked the chef where he suggested that I would go to culinary school. And he said that he takes all of his interns here, so figured it was worth looking into. Came down and took a tour and was very impressed with everything and the, uh, the personality of the staff and how small the classes are and down to earth everything is and it, it blew me away. <laughs> what was it like when you first started school? Was it harder than you thought it was going to be or easier or what surprised you? It was about what it needed to be when I started. Um, it's kind of what I expected. I'm going through the really basic stuff, this is what the kitchen stuff is, and this is what all your equipment is. Um, it was where I needed to start, and then it ended where I, uh, knowing more than I thought that I would coming out of this program. Anything to add? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right? Yeah. Okay. I think the good days and the bad days are usually the same one. It's like the really stressful project days where something is due and you're working your butt off to get it done, and then in the end it's over and you're just like... Yeah, you're just like relaxed and it's over and you feel so accomplished that like, oh, I did this and I made this and yeah. it happened. Yeah. Anything that you're, you're able to do that you never thought you'd be able to do? Hmm. Like the fancy decorating, I think, yeah. was definitely like a goal of mine. Like I've always wanted to do like beautiful plating and that sort of thing. And so it's really fun to be like, oh, I can do that. Like I know how to make something like that looks really extravagant and amazing. Like I can do simply. So. That's an awesome thing for me. Yeah, plating was really daunting, and now it's like... <laughs> <laughs> Cut it cool, put it on a plate, sauce it, and it looks awesome. Yeah. That's pretty cool. You know, I don't know, you get out of this program what you put into it, and if you stick it out and you do your best through the entire program, I don't think you can have any regrets. Yeah. I don't really... Mm -mm. <laughs> Just hate her as often as I could. I don't know if you can be like a hundred percent prepared. Like I think you just need to be able to, like, be confident in yourself that you know you'll make it through, and like be ready for that, and be, mm. yeah, be dedicated enough when you start it to make it all the way through. Yeah, and I'd say come in early and get your money's worth out of the program. Um, definitely ask as many questions as pop into your head. Don't be yeah. afraid to find someone and have them explain what you're doing or why you're doing it or. Um, that sort of thing. I'm going to St. Honoré, a bakery in northeast Portland. They do fine French pastries and sandwiches and breads and um, lots of things. Fancy. <laughs> You'll be doing everything? Everything, there? yeah. Great. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to the Oregon Golf Club and I'm going to be um, like interning under a pastry chef there and working in the restaurant and the salad and the whole restaurant area, so I'm very excited. Any thoughts about long term what you want to do? Um, this, <laughs> yeah. baking is uh, it's definitely a passion. You don't get into this industry unless you really enjoy doing it and you can see yourself going far. Um, so at the moment, I'm putting one foot in front of the other and we're going to kind of see where that goes. Don't have any real short term goals, but I'm excited. I can go anywhere pretty much. Uh, for me, I really want to go uh, work on a cruise ship in a couple of years, so I'm excited for my externship because it's putting me into the restaurant environment and that sort of thing, so I'm hoping to improve all my baking skills, plating, and fancy things, and be there soon. Uh, thank you to all the chefs. I know they definitely. definitely put in a lot of work into each of us and taught us a ton. Like They're very amazing and ins inspirational, for sure. I second that. <laughs> Did it. All right. Well, thank you guys both very much. Yeah. Thank you. Good thank luck you. to you. Thanks.